happened at the masquerade located inside underground Atlanta. Good news, Mark Teichner is live downtown for us with the very latest on this. Mark, good morning. Well, good morning, guys. The club was packed with folks enjoying a rap concert when an argument broke out. Next thing you knew, there was shooting, two guys dead, two more hurt, and that gunman now on the loose. We had one that was uh, died on the scene. Another was transported to Grady, who uh, later died. Gunfire rings out at an underground Atlanta nightclub, leaving two dead and two others hurt. Police say around 9.30 Sunday night, an argument broke out in between shows at the crowded masquerade. During the dispute, uh, two of the people who were targeted were, were shot. From what we believe, the other two were not the intended victims. The intended target, both of the men died. One at the scene, the other at the hospital. The innocent bystanders, who were also men, were shot in the lower body and at last check in stable condition. The club was packed with fans there to see L.A.-based rapper Cousin Stiz. The second act was done. They were at a uh, break in between the second act and the third act, who was about to come on stage when this incident occurred. Detectives aren't sure what what caused the beef that led up to the shooting, they hope to use club security cameras and witnesses to piece it all together. And there were, of course, a lot of people inside, but once the shooting occurred, as, as is understandable, a lot of the people ran out and left the location. Investigators are asking those folks to come forward so they can bring justice to the victims' families. We want to get their versions of the story and find out what happened and who did who did this. The headliner, Cousin Stiz, did release a statement on Twitter saying he's completely heartbroken. It also stated, I have always called my shows family reunions because they're never anything but fun, safe, good vibes, and positivity. I am in shock and at loss of words for this senseless violence. Anyone with information about this case is asked to call Atlanta Police. You can also get a hold of Crime Stopper. So reporting live from downtown Atlanta, I'm Mark Teichner for Good Day Atlanta. Mark, thank you.